Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing an apartment haul. I'm going to be showing you guys some things that I got for my apartment, mainly for like my room and the kitchen purposes. Um, but I'm going to be showing you guys a few things I picked up. I am recycling a lot of the things that I used last year for my room, which I know I said I was going to do a dorm room haul and I never got around to doing it because by the time that I was ready to do it, my room was always just like chaotic and just wasn't the way that it was when I first set it up. So I am going to actually do an apartment, or not an apartment haul, probably not an apartment haul just because it's a lot of... Um, like, it's not, like, my personal space, so I have to, like, see if that's okay with my roommates and everything, but, um, I will be doing, like, a room tour uh, for my apartment. Sorry, I had my laptop on my lap and it was really annoying, so I put it behind me. But if you're new to my channel, welcome. My name's Kayla. Um, welcome to the fam. Don't forget to hit that like button and that subscribe button and comment, you know, let me know any of the pieces and things that you see here if you like them and what you think. And I'm going to stop rambling because probably not making that much sense, but let's get on to the video. So I'm going to start off with, I don't even know, I think like kitchen stuff because I got some things for my kitchen, but not everything. The way it's turned turning out is that everybody's just kind of bringing their own things with them, I guess. I don't really know. I tried to ask and no one really answered me, so I'm just going to go ahead because we're moving in like next week. So I'm just go going to go ahead and buy my own things for myself. I didn't get everything, so don't say like, Kayla, this, you need more than that to cook. Like, I know, but these are the things that I've got recently. So I stopped by Target, of course, everybody's favorite place. On earth to start off I had to get like some um, flatware so I got this set so this comes with four forks four knives four teaspoons or spoons and a wire caddy so I don't know if I'm gonna use the caddy but it would make sense because I think everybody's bringing their own flatware I know it sounds stupid like why would everybody bring their own but one girl has an out like food allergies so she kind of has to keep her stuff separate and then I don't really know what everyone else is doing. I think, like, my roommate, like, the one that we share, like, the room together, she's bringing her own, so I might as well just bring my own, too. So I might put this in the caddy, which would actually work well, instead of putting it in the drawer so we don't get them all mixed up. So I'll probably just, like, put this in the kitchen in the caddy. And lately I've been really liking grays and, like, blues and stuff for the kitchen, so, at least for my stuff. So I picked up this, and it just has, like, this gray stuff. I mean, if my you know, dishes and stuff all don't match 100%. It's fine. It's not like my real life apartment. It's just my school, college apartment, um, which I don't know if I explained that. So basically, I am living in an uh, off-campus apartment. It's just for like the school year. It's literally like from June to June, like a 12-month lease or whatever. And um, we're all moving in like next week. And then school starts the week after, or not the week, yeah, the week after. So like that Tuesday, the 30th is when school officially starts everybody that like lives off campus pretty much comes in the week before at some point and moves in so I'm gonna start like moving in like Tuesday on I don't live incredibly far from my college so I can just kind of go back and forth and bring things at a time so I don't feel rushed and everything but for my room situation, to explain, you guys will see it eventually because I'm going to do a room tour, probably of just my half, not my other roommate, um, not her part, unless, like, she wants me to put it in there, then I will, but, like, it's probably just going to be my part, but you will see the way, the way that I explain our room, you'll see it in person in a video, but basically, our room is, um, one big room, and then it's divided with a half wall, so it's one room but it has like a divider i guess so we have our own space you like physically can't see the other person for the most part of the room but um there's a half wall and that's where the two closets are in so it's an open closet like there's no door to the closet so i might either put a curtain up or just keep my closet really clean i had that freshman year in my dorm and it was really an incentive an incentive to keep my closet clean so I'll probably just you know keep it open i don't know showcase all my like really nice the nice looking clothes just to, like add something to the room possibly but yeah so that is my room situation um and we have like a bathroom to us too we share a bathroom i'm rambling it's not really making sense so sorry but i have four roommates there's five of us total so like Kayla and I, which my roommate's name is Kayla, if you don't already know, it makes things confusing, I'm aware. Kayla and I have 
one room. We have a bathroom with the half wall. And then um, Julia and Amber have their own room with the half wall. And then Jen is downstairs in her room, which is a single. So, and obviously, like, Amber and Julia have their own bathroom. And then Jen has her bathroom, which is also, like, the um, public bathroom for, like, guests and stuff. So, anyways... <laughs> Don't really know how to, why I had to explain all that, but just to kind of set the tone for my apartment. There you go. That's what it's like. So for the rest of my kitchen stuff, I just kind of got utensils for now. Like, I will go and get, like, the pans and the uh, dining set and stuff like that. And, like, my strainer and cutting board and cutting knives and, like, all the really, really like, essentials for cooking. I'm not going to get, like... All the extra stuff that I know I'm not going to use but like the essentials that I will need obviously I'll need like a couple pans and like um, cooking sheets and stuff like that like cookie sheet like you know like the flat ones and stuff like that then obviously I'm gonna get those but for now I still have like time I have all next week to go and get the rest of the stuff but this is just stuff that I got for now so I got this um, like spatula turner it's called a slotted turner um, so it's just like in this nice little, I don't know, like seafoam green. What is this color called? I don't even know. It's like that green color. That's really pretty. That It's a mint green. Oh my god, I'm such an idiot. It's like a mint green or like seafoam green color. I'm trying to show you guys like the actual color. So it's just this one, um, and it's really cute. This was only like $1.49 or something. The flatware that I got was like $10.99, I believe. So then I just got like this um, solid spoon. This would be good for cooking. Obviously, it's good for cooking. But this is like an essential that somebody would need. So um, it just looks like this. This was $1.49 as well. I also got this silicone spatula. Um, and it's just a gray color. So all of these actually came, like, they were all just sitting together in this thing. And I thought they all pretty much go together. So I think these are going to be, like, my colors for my kitchenware. Like, the grays and the blues and mint greens and stuff. So here's just this silicone spatula. That was a dollar something as well. Um, and then I have these tongs, which are this gray color. And this was $3.99, I believe. So this is the most expensive out of, like, these individual pieces that I got. And it locks and unlocks. So you can lock it so it stays like this. Or you can push this thing and it unlocks and pops out. So I thought that was pretty cool. So for hanging things, I do have a, um, what is it called, a tapestry that I used last year that I may or may not use again. It depends on how small it makes my room feel. If it makes it feel really tiny, then I'll just take it down. If it doesn't, and it... I feel like it adds something, then I will add it into my room. If not, then I just, you know, won't use it. But I got these um, hanging command strips. So they just look like this. So it's just the clear ones. Please excuse my nails. I know I need to get them done. Um, every I'm just going to get them done when I'm done working because every time that I paint my nails or get them done, they always get ruined. Literally like day two of working after getting them done. So I just don't even bother anymore. So just excuse them right now. They will get better. And then I got these large set picture hanging ones. And these will be good because I have... Um, canvases I want to put up and stuff and these somehow I'm going to attach my um what is it called my tapestry with I think my roommate used something like this or I also have like lights that I could put these on as well so I'll find a purpose for these and then these I know that I'll use for sure because I do have a canvas that I used last year which is in the back of my videos if you like scroll back a little bit to the school year you will see it and it just drop my glasses just don't even but my colors in case you guys weren't aware it's kind of like it's the same I'm using the same bed spread that I used last year so it's like that pinky color I'm using a lot of whites a little bit touches of gray because I have these pull out drawers which you'll see in my apartment or my room tour um that has like some gray in it but also gold so I know like those colors gray and gold like seems kind of weird but, but it'll all come together because my painting or my canvas has like some gray in it and gold so it'll all everything's gonna come together so like I just grabbed a couple pieces that I am gonna be using next year or for this year that I had previously so I have this K I actually got it from TJ Maxx um so this is white it has like a little bit of um grayish brown on the finish of it I don't know if you could really tell 
but it's like this it's just more of like a distress kind of like little k for kayla obviously and then i just have this mirror which i like sloppily painted gold because it was originally like this blue color which is from my freshman year dorm and i mean i don't really care it's just like this little vanity mirror so i just kind of spray painted it gold to go with my room i know it's kind of a hot mess but it's whatever it's just a little mirror okay so the last two pieces actually are for my room like designated for my room um it is this black lamp that i have that goes with the rest of my furniture um it's just this nice one that has like two things so i can kind of adjust it or whatever i think you can adjust it well, I can adjust like the position it's at so that I can get the lighting where I need it. So this is my first time getting a floor lamp for like I shared like one of my dorm rooms, I guess. Um, because there's only one light fixture in our room and it's only on one side. I figured we might as well both just get like floor lamps or like some type of lamp. So that in case one of us turns the light out, the other can have their side lit if they want. <laughs> oh my god, I'm so corny. That sounded so corny, but like so it can be well lit, not like it's lit. Like her side's lit like not like that and then finally i have this some people call it a boyfriend this big pillow thing so finally some people call it like a boyfriend i don't really know but i needed another one of these i had it freshman year but it's like this blue one and it doesn't go anymore because i was really into like blues and teals i don't know my room freshman year was kind of a hot mess but whatever um but i just got this white one because it goes with everything in my room um and so yeah, I got both of these from Target. The lamp was $10.99 and the boyfriend or whatever this pillow thing is called um, was $11.99. So that is the end of the video. I really hope you guys enjoyed. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Let me know any new videos you guys want to see. And I will see you guys in my next one. Bye guys! I'm telling you a lot about college because I am a junior in college now. It's so scary to say that. I'm like halfway done and it's terrifying because it's just one step closer to adulting and I don't even want to think about that right now but if you haven't already go ahead and click the subscribe button so that you can stay updated see what I'm doing in college see any more advice videos or any like makeup and fashion and hair and all that stuff videos